You must be Steven. Am I saying this right? Whiskers? That's me. All right, welcome. Can put your bags in the foyer. I'll show you where you're staying. Don't touch anything. Hey, Dragon Man, get off the line. Sorry about that. That old fool thinks he can stand where he wants for free. Blind nuisance. Not on my block. Uh... Huh. Yeah. I'm sorry, I haven't even introduced myself. My name's Officer Tyler, and for the next 12 months, I will be your corrections officer at the Southwest Minneapolis House Arrest Detention Facility. As of today, June 15th, 2011, you are officially under house arrest. I got your ankle bracelet, I got you a medium, works for most guys, but if yours are cankles, we got room in the budget to spring for a large. Try it on. Uh, yeah, that works. All right, well, I guess that takes care of most of the government business, but we got a few house rules that you might not be familiar with. Rule number one, no drinking. This is a sober establishment. That means no beer, no wine, red or white, no gin, no rum, no wine coolers, and most importantly, no jug wine. Rule number two, pants mandatory. Keep them on. Rule number three, no hats indoors. I see one, it's mine. You forget the rules, we got a poster. Got it. Uh, Tyler, new guy? Vaughn, you're in violation again. Sorry about that, he gets a little out of hand sometimes. Anyway, Steven, your room's second floor, down the hall, first on the left. Take your stuff on up, I'll come get you when it's almost time for dinner. Probably be ready around 6.30. Vincent, you rascal! So, uh, what are you in for, brother? Oh, uh, I, I'm not sure that this is polite dinner conversation. Oh, there. come on, man. We're gonna be roommates for a while. Might as well get to know each other. Where to begin? <laughs> there was a man. Drunk. My wife was with child. He came out of nowhere. Attacked her. I, I, I took him down. Did what I had to do, but I... I never thought that I... Never believed that I was capable of... of... Oh man. So... Just like Nick Cage and Con Air. Uh, I don't really see how you could draw the comparison between... Sounds like Nick Cage and Con Air. Yeah, okay, it was exactly like Nick Cage and Con Air. Man, you know what I can't believe about that movie? I guess we're done talking about my conviction now. Flew a freaking plane onto the Las Vegas Strip. I bet the city was never the same after that. You know, I don't, I don't think he actually flew a plane onto a... Uh... Hell of a movie, man. Hell of a movie. So, uh, what are you in for? Forging stamps? What do you care? Dinner's ready. Vaughn, why don't you start the salad? Do not rush me, Tyler! I'm picking out my sauce! He gets like that on an empty stomach. Oh, that must be Leslie. Rent's overdue. She's collecting. Steven, as you're new, you don't owe me anything. Vaughn, do you have the check for your share? Tyler, I'm putting ketchup on my salad right now. Alright, alright. Just get it to me by the weekend, okay? Leslie, you must be here about the rent. Yep, late again. I know, guilty. Well, we were actually just sitting down to dinner, um, but would you like to join us for a drink? Uh, no drink, thank you, but I will come inside. I'd like to see how your new resident is settling in. Hello, Steven. I trust the move is a comfortable one. Here you go, Leslie. Sure I can't convince you to stay? What was she doing here? That was the sentencing judge at my court hearing. She's the one who put me in here. You are not alone, brother. Like half the guys that have been through this house got sentenced to house arrest by Leslie. Me, Big Jim, Doc Louie, Brickhouse, Son of Brickhouse, Jed the Hemophiliac, Rufus the Black Redneck, Copper Tone, Stevie Ballburner, Stevie Ball Baron, Baron Von Schmeckelstein, Count Baroness the Androgynous Tyrant, Victor Von Shroom, 
Denim Rick, Pasta Vajuli, Joey Six Knives, the Chucklebuck Strangler. Personally, I think it's a money-making scheme. Hey, I will not hear anything negative said about Leslie. She is a lovely professional lady. If you two are done, you can be excused. All right, now on Mondays, we play Monopoly. Monday Night Monopoly, Monopoly Night Monday, Monday Apoly Panama Night, I don't care what you call it, learn to like it. Some traditions, you just don't fuck with. No, no, not at all. I, I love Monopoly, actually. <laughs> all right, great. We're here. Have a beer. Yeah, I, I, I think I'm good. Oh, come on, man. We're all friends here. Right, but Officer Tyler's- Man, involved. look, how long are you going to let him tell you what to do? It's one of the house rules, okay? I'll just keep- Uh, oh. And I'm just gonna put that one down there. Whoa! 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 The hell's wrong with you, Whiskers? I expected better, Steven. What? What? What did I do wrong? Coasters at all times. I mean, that's just common sense. I called the cannon! After last time, you don't get to be the cannon. Oh, that healed, didn't it? You can be the thimble. I ain't being no thimble. Is there a lights out time? We'll worry about a lights out time once you learn how to use a coaster. I know how to use a coaster. I'll believe it when I see it. I'm the race car. 